Payne Chevrolet, nine decades, four generations, one tradition. Authorities in Springfield are investigating after a barrage of gunfire and 911 calls Saturday night. Robertson County EMS, the Springfield Fire Department, the Springfield Police Department, with the assistance of the Robertson County Sheriff's Office, were all called to multiple scenes over the span of about an hour starting just after 10 p.m. Springfield Police are leading the investigation that includes at least two different locations. This is a developing story, but what we have pieced together so far is the first call came into 911 at 10.07 p.m. Saturday night. First responders were called to the parking area of Ichabon Restaurant on Memorial Boulevard regarding a 43-year-old woman that had been struck by a ricochet round. After an assessment, the victim was not transported. Then, at 10.38 p.m., about 30 minutes later, first responders were called back to Ichabon to reassess the victim. According to Robertson County EMS, the woman was transported to TriStar Northcrest Medical Center in Springfield with minor injuries. And moving forward in time, a flood of calls comes in to 911 regarding shots fired at 18th Avenue West and Leota Street at 11.04 p.m. What appeared to be evidence markers for at least 30 shell casings were visible in the middle of the street with a vehicle in the center of police activity. At least three rounds struck a home during the barrage of gunfire on 18th Avenue West. Fortunately, the family was not home, but two rounds did penetrate a bedroom window and a third went through the front door of the home. A very dangerous situation if someone had been home. We also have several reports and we are still trying to confirm that a second shooting victim was transported to TriStar Northcrest by private vehicle. We do not know their condition. And police were also seen in the parking lot of Elmo's, a Mocahete Mexican restaurant, also on Memorial Boulevard, which is next door to Ichabon, both very popular eateries in Springfield. What we do not know and what police are investigating is if the multiple scenes are in any way connected. As soon as officials in Springfield have had enough time to piece things together and release a statement to the press, we will bring it to you. We did ask Springfield police if there was any danger to the surrounding community or if a suspect was in custody, and we were told that they could not make a statement at this time. If you're looking for new furniture, there's no reason to drive for miles. Stuart Williams Furniture is conveniently located in the heart of Springfield on Memorial Boulevard with over 30,000 square feet of fine furnishings. We have over 90 years of experience and carry major brands like Ashley, Lazy Boy, Lane, Hillsdale, Frigidaire, and many more. Our friendly professional staff is ready to help you with all of your questions. We know the importance of finding the right price in the right wood, color, fabric, and design. We also offer financing to make your purchase a little easier on your budget. Are the kids in need of a new bed? Maybe dad needs a new recliner to unwind after a long day. Or is it time to spring for that new flat screen TV you've always wanted? We guarantee competitive prices, the best brand names with professional delivery and installation. So remember, at Stewart Williams, customer satisfaction is our top priority. So come see us today.